Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be showing you how to add that little personalization box to any of your products inside of Shopify. It's super easy, takes five minutes or less, and if you know the drill, we're gonna jump into my computer and I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to go to the Shopify App Store and you're going to want to download this app called PX Variants and Product Options. So they have a free plan available and I'm actually going to add this app to one of my uh, website clients website right now and I'm gonna show you exactly how easy it is to do this. So once you add this app to the store, all you're going to do is open the app up and I will go back and just show you um, what it looks like when you open up the app. So when you open up the app, as you can see, all of the products will be listed right here. And for example, I have already added the personalization option to this one, and now I'm going to add it to this product. So I'm simply gonna find the product I wanna add the personalization to and click add. Next, I'm going to give it a title. So I'm just going to say, add your personalization select the type, whether it's an image, short text, long text, etc. I'm going to do long text and then the instruction. So I'm going to say, please share the following one name. birthday, date, time, and location. Okay, so these are all of the instructions that she needed, but essentially what you could do is you could just go through, just give your personalization a title. You could just keep it something uh, short and simple like that. And then the next one, you could just in this box, just quickly explain exactly what you're needing. Um, you can give it an additional price if needed. I don't, you can also change the color right there, but I just want the font to be black. So we'll leave it as that. And then um, you can select required and then just simply click add. Now, as you can see a little preview, so this is what the text box is going to look like. And if you wanted to see what it would look like on your website, all you would do is just click open product. And now when I scroll down, you will see that the personalization box has been added and there is all of my instructions. It's as simple as that. 